So Sony's going to be re-releasing every live-action Spider-Man movie in theaters. That means everyone's going to get the chance to see every Spider-Man actor on the big screen again. So it's a part of Sony's celebration for 100 years of Columbia Pictures. They'll be popping back up in theaters the same order they were originally released, beginning in April and going through June, coming out every Monday. The release schedule for the movies includes Spider-Man on April 15th, Spider-Man 2 on April 22nd, Spider-Man 3 on April 29th, The Amazing Spider-Man on May 6th, The Amazing Spider-Man 2 on May 13th, Spider-Man Homecoming on May 20th, Spider-Man 5 from Home on May 27th, and Spider-Man No Way Home on June 3rd. No, I'm definitely not going to go see all of them as it's kind of expensive, but also I've seen the Andrew Garfield and Tom Holland movies in theaters, but I wasn't born for the first Tobey Maguire movie and I was too young for the second and third ones. Spider-Man 3 is kind of bad, so I don't really care about that one, but, but the first two are certified classics and are definitely worth watching in theaters. Overall, I'm excited for it and as a Spider-Man fan, we'll be checking it out, at least the Sam Raimi trilogy.